Torque Element presents. For nearly a decade, Tesla's heartbeat has been powered by one chemistry, lithium ion. It's the battery that made electric cars a revolution, not just a dream, but even revolutions have limits. Lithium ion has carried Tesla this far, yet behind its impressive performance lie two ticking problems safety and weight. These two flaws are the walls keeping electric mobility from becoming truly universal, truly affordable, and truly safe for everyone, especially the millions of older Americans ready to embrace EVs without anxiety. That's why Elon Musk has spent the past year buried inside gigafactory walls, surrounded by engineers and prototypes, chasing a solution that could change everything. Not a tweak, a reset. And what they're building inside those walls may be the final chapter of lithium-ion's long reign. The future might belong to something simpler, cleaner, and safer, aluminum ion. The Model 2 Tesla's long-promised $25,000 EV is the key to this story. A car meant to bring electric driving to the masses, affordable, efficient, and reliable enough to trust your life with it. But to make that price possible without cutting corners, Tesla needed a breakthrough battery. One lighter, cheaper, faster charging, and virtually incombustible. Aluminum ion didn't just step up to the challenge. It shattered expectations. Imagine this. You drive into a charging station, plug in, grab a coffee, scroll your phone, and before you finish a single message, your Tesla is fully charged. Not in an hour. Not in half an hour. In under 60 seconds. That's not a fantasy. That's what aluminum ion batteries have already demonstrated in lap scale tests. At their core, these batteries are built differently from the lithium cells that power every Tesla on the road today. Instead of using a graphite anode soaked in a volatile, flammable liquid, aluminum ion batteries use a solid aluminum metal anode and a graphene based cathode. Between them flows an electrolyte that isn't toxic or flammable, it's water based or ionic liquid. Safe enough to handle without gloves. Stable enough to survive heat that would turn a lithium battery into a fireball. When charging, aluminum ions travel about three times faster than lithium ions, moving through the structure like bullets through air. That means charging speeds that blow past anything seen in EVs today. No heat spikes, no runaway reactions, no cooling systems screaming to keep up. In tests run by Graphene Manufacturing Group in the University of Queensland, these cells fully charged in less than one minute, not once, but repeatedly. Now let's talk longevity. Lithium cells degrade. Over time, dendrites, tiny metallic spikes, grow inside, eventually shorting the cell and killing its capacity. Aluminum doesn't do that. No dendrites. No internal scarring. In early tests, aluminum ion batteries survived more than 10,000 charge cycles while still retaining over 90% of their capacity. To put that into perspective, a typical lithium pack lasts about 1,500 to 2,000 cycles. You could drive a Tesla with aluminum batteries for two decades and still have a battery that feels almost new. And power? These cells don't just last, they hit harder. Aluminum ion boasts three to four times the power density of lithium. That means faster acceleration, stronger regenerative braking, and a driving feel that's pure Tesla DNA, instant torque but delivered with surgical smoothness. Environmentally, aluminum ion checks every box lithium couldn't. Aluminum is one of Earth's most abundant elements, roughly 8% of the planet's crust. Lithium? Less than 0.002%. That abundance translates directly into affordability. Aluminum-based cells could cost less than $40 per kilowatt hour, half the price of lithium packs today. No cobalt. No nickel. No manganese. Nothing rare, nothing mined under questionable conditions and nothing toxic to recycle. The entire pack could be melted down and reused. Now pause and imagine what that means for a car like the Tesla Model 2. A vehicle designed to cost less than $25,000. If your battery, the single most expensive component, suddenly becomes cheaper, lighter, and safer you're not just cutting costs. You're changing the economics of electric mobility itself. But what really makes aluminum ion revolutionary isn't just numbers on a chart. It's what happens when things go wrong. Every EV today lives with the same silent risk, thermal runaway. The chain reaction that turns a damaged lithium battery into a fire that can burn for hours. When a lithium cell heats beyond 150 degrees Celsius, it vents gas, feeds on oxygen, and ignites neighboring cells. In less than 10 seconds, that reaction can hit 900 degrees. The fire doesn't need air, it creates its own. Even the most advanced EV fire takes over 11,000 liters of water to extinguish. Aluminum ion flips that story completely. Its water-based or ionic electrolyte doesn't burn. It stays stable up to 300 degrees Celsius, almost twice lithium's limit. 
puncture it, crush it, submerge it, nothing happens. In testing, aluminum ion cells were stabbed with steel nails, heated past 250 degrees, and even dunked in salt water. The result? No explosion. No smoke. Just a slow, quiet rise of about 8 degrees before stabilizing. Even overcharging, the most dangerous scenario for lithium, doesn't phase aluminum. When pushed to twice its rated capacity, lithium packs vent gases in under two minutes. Aluminum cells? No gas. No swelling. No fire. Just calm, steady voltage. And if you think that's impressive, listen to this. In flood simulations, aluminum ion packs were submerged in salt water for 48 hours. They showed no corrosion, no swelling, and when dried, regained over 90% of their original capacity. Imagine an EV that could survive a flood, dry off, and start again the next morning. That's the kind of resilience aluminum chemistry offers. It's not just theory. When crash tested at 50 km per hour, traditional lithium packs reached internal temperatures of over 310 degrees. Aluminum ion? Less than 95. No sparks. No ignition. No runaway reaction. Because each cell contains its own thermal boundaries, the heat can't jump from one to another. That means no chain reaction. No meltdown. No need for 200 pounds of protective armor. And that leads to another revolution, weight. The aluminum ion pack Tesla is designing for the Model 2 doesn't need the heavy cooling loops or multi-layered steel shells that lithium packs require. That alone cuts 75 to 100 kilograms from the structure. Then, by removing the active cooling system, the fans, pipes, glycol fluids, and radiators, Tesla saves another 10%. In total, you're looking at a reduction of nearly 100 kilograms from the chassis level. Now, every 100 kilograms shaved off a car equals a 5 to 7% gain in range. So even a smaller aluminum ion pack, say 45 to 50 kilowatt hours, could deliver 400 to 480 kilometers, or around 250 to 300 miles of real-world range. The same range as today's lithium-based Model 3, but with less material, less cost, and less complexity. Lighter weight means more than range. It means quicker response, sharper handling, and shorter braking. A 100 kilogram reduction trims 0 to 60 miles per hour acceleration by about 0.1 seconds and shortens braking distance by up to 5%. And because aluminum has a high specific strength, Tesla's engineers can use the battery casing itself as part of the car's structural skeleton. The pack becomes the floor, the spine, and the strength all in one, integrating directly with the front and rear gigacast sections. That design improves chassis rigidity by as much as 15%. You feel it every time you turn the wheel, less body roll, tighter response, more control. For a smaller car like the Model 2, that means driving dynamics that feel premium, even when priced for the mainstream. And here's where things get even more fascinating. Without the heavy armor or cooling components, Tesla can simplify the entire pack assembly. The 2019 era packs used nearly 370 individual parts. The new aluminum ion structural design uses fewer than 100. That means faster manufacturing, easier recycling, and lower labor costs. Gigafactory Texas could produce these packs 35% faster than current lithium designs. In other words, fewer parts, fewer risks, fewer costs. More performance. More safety. More freedom. Now let's take a step back. For decades, we were told energy storage couldn't evolve fast enough. That lithium was the limit. But the truth is, technology doesn't move in straight lines. It leaps. And this might be Tesla's next great leap. Elon Musk once said, physics is the law. Everything else is just a recommendation. Aluminum ion follows that rule perfectly. By replacing unstable organic solvents with stable ionic fluids, Tesla removes the weakest link in EV safety. By trading rare metals for abundant ones, it breaks the cost barrier. And by building batteries that double as structure, it redefines how vehicles are designed from the ground up. But the question remains, when will it happen? When will we see aluminum ion inside an actual Tesla? Insiders suggest prototypes are already under evaluation at Gigafactory Texas. Small format cells are being tested for durability, efficiency, and compatibility with Tesla's existing power electronics. The timeline? Late 2026, the same window Musk hinted for the launch of the Model 2. The goal isn't to replace lithium overnight, but to launch aluminum ion alongside it, starting with compact, affordable Teslas where safety and cost matter most. Because for many Americans, especially those over 50, EV adoption isn't just about performance or looks. It's about trust, safety, simplicity, the confidence to drive without worrying about battery fires, expensive replacements, or complicated maintenance. Aluminum ion delivers all three. Imagine your daily life with it. You park at a grocery store, plug in, and in under a minute, you're charged. No waiting. No overheating. The battery doesn't wear out after a few years. It doesn't fear rain, snow, or heat. 
You don't pay for rare materials or fragile cooling systems. You just drive. For decades. Safely. Quietly. For Tesla, this technology doesn't just mean cheaper cars. It means accessibility. It means an EV for everyone, from young commuters in cities to retirees in the suburbs. It means the Model 2 could become not just Tesla's most affordable car, but its most important one. The model that finally completes the circle Elon Musk drew over a decade ago when he said Tesla's mission was to accelerate the world's transition to sustainable energy. Think about it, a battery that charges in 60 seconds. A structure that's part of the car's skeleton. A chemistry that can't catch fire, can't corrode, and costs half as much as today's technology. That's not just innovation. That's revolution through simplification. But, of course, revolutions don't come easy. Scaling aluminum ion to mass production means retraining gigafactory lines, re-engineering supply chains, and ensuring long-term stability in real-world driving conditions. But Tesla has faced tougher transitions, from hand-built roadsters to millions of Model YS, from vertical door dreams to 4,680 cell reality. Every great leap in Tesla's story began the same way, with skepticism. And yet, here we are, driving vehicles once thought impossible. So, what does aluminum ion mean for the rest of the industry? It means competition. It means companies like Toyota, BYD, and Volkswagen must rethink their roadmaps. It means that what was once a futuristic concept locked in a lab could soon become the heart of a car built for everyday people. Safe enough for families, strong enough for highways, and simple enough to trust. If the Model 2 truly rolls out with aluminum ion batteries, it will mark the beginning of a new era, not just for Tesla but for all of us. The era of instant charging, fireproof, affordable EVs. A world where clean transportation doesn't demand compromise. Because sometimes, progress doesn't come from making things bigger or more complex. It comes from making them better, lighter, and smarter. That's exactly what aluminum ion represents. A return to the simplest question in engineering. What if we could do more, with less? And as Tesla edges closer to unveiling the Model 2, one thing is certain. This time, smaller might mean smarter, cheaper might mean safer, and lighter might just mean the future. If this glimpse into the next stage of Tesla's evolution sparked something in you, join the Torque Element community, where 11,975 of you already ride along on this journey into the electric age. Because what's coming next might not just change how we drive, but how we think about energy itself.